Maine has close to 5,000 electric cars on the road today. That's according to data from the U.S. Department of Energy, and that number might be increasing very soon. New Center Maine's Caroline LaCour breaks down what was discussed at a deliberative session on whether Maine will be the next state to adopt a California-enacted emissions program. Cleaner roads may be on the horizon for Mainers, with the Maine Board of Environmental Protection voting to prepare for the adoption of California's emission standards. The rules will bring billions of dollars in benefits to the state in terms of air quality benefits, health benefits, consumer benefits. A deliberative session Tuesday touched on California's Advanced Clean Cars Act 2 rule, which would require zero emission cars to make up at least 43 percent of new sales in 2027 and 82 percent of those sales by 2032. The board identified a number of different issues mostly regarding uncertainty. Taking into consideration over 1,600 public comments on the proposal, board members sifted through possible pitfalls, like if Maine's charging infrastructure is up for the demand, especially in rural areas. The marketplace is changing whether we like it or not. One big concern, a lack of incentives for both manufacturers to increase the number of EVs they send to dealerships and for average Mainers who feel they simply can't afford a new EV. Two other worries, say critics, anxiety drivers still have over how far they can get on a single charge, as well as not having the freedom to choose what they want to drive. I really don't think this deliberative body is the right one to make this, this level of, of a, a policy decision. Today's vote was an informal straw vote, but it signals what the board may do when it votes again later this year. But some believe a step this big should be made by a larger body, namely the legislature. I know that there's some nuance in, in, the, in the language, but at the end of the day, it limits the sale of certain types of vehicles. And in rural Maine, uh, this is going to be extremely destructive. Whatever happens, it's certain changes coming somewhere down the road. In Augusta, Caroline LaCour, News Center, Maine. The board also decided not to advance a similar proposal to encourage the sales of electric trucks at Tuesday's discussion.